Okay, everybody, today I will present about the Google Glass. Um, human, you know, try to um, develop a device or a gadget that make um, the human live more easier. And I'm talking about this one, the Google Glass. Uh, should we get started? Yes. Okay. Um, for the background, the Google company. I'm surely all of you guys know this website because you open it every day. And all of your information, all of your PowerPoint, uh, anything come from this website, I am pretty sure. This company, founded in 1994 in California, um, the, the, um, the main, the main, that this website do is like a search engine, you know. You can get anything or uh, every information that you want on this website. And it also provides many, many um, applications and many, many productivity tools. Like, they just launched the Singlicity and uh, many, many, like, uh, I found, but in the Google, you know. So, and it provides also the Android, the mobile phone system that has almost uh, one application, a uh, one million application available. Um, next thing I will go with the ice cream product timeline. The computer become more popular in 1998 because of the widespread of the internet. So the people uh, buy more the, of the personal computer. After that, around 2003, the laptop become more popular because of you know the breakthrough technology of the wireless. So you can have the computer everywhere, and you can search for the information everywhere. For around 2008, I think uh, it's the breakthrough era of the smartphone. Apple launched the iPhone, and the Android also um, fully developed with the version, and also it's becoming of the tablet also. So. Um, and it's kind of end of this era. I'm talking about the next thing is like the Google Glass. Okay, have you ever think about? You can access anything, everywhere, every time, just in blink of your eyes, <coughs> anywhere, and it's like pretty easy, you know. It's 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 the game changer. It changed the whole world. Okay, I will talk a little bit about the future first. The augmented reality. I have seen Iron Man, right? Um, the Jarvis, the Iron Man system, is one of the augmented reality, but it's kind of a, you know, it's, it's, it's in the movie. But in reality, the augmented reality is like just a fully developed uh, reality, but it's not fully functional because you have to put your phone and overlay it around the object to scan and same with the database, what it is. But the Google Glass, you just look at it, you know, and uh, it will sync for you and it will show the information just right in before your eyes. And part of your camera, this one, you can record anything that you see, and it's like pretty easy because you just like you wear the glasses and everybody can see and can, because after you record it, you can share it. Everybody can see what you see. Okay, and my colleagues will tell you another thing. Okay, so after you listen to Jimmy, um, <coughs> I would like to ask you some question. Uh, do you think that Google Glass can make our life more convenient and easier? Please raise your hand. Thank you. So me too. I, I think that Google Glass is a thing that created to make our life simple. Because in the past, we wear the accessories like the watch, your glasses, um, your earring or necklace. When you want to search for some information, you go to your personal computer or laptop. And today, in the present, you still wear those accessories, right? Okay, so in this class, you wear like a watch, wear glass. Okay, thank you. So I can see that almost 90% or maybe 80% of you wear those accessories. And, but today, we have the smartphone and tablet. So we don't need those laptops and computers in, in order to 
search for our information. And in the future, I think that, and I'm sorry, do you think that we will gonna wear this kind of accessory? Yes, right. But um, we don't need to carry those smartphones or tablet anymore. Because the next trend is about to combine the accessory with the computer, like two in one. So it makes our life more easier. We don't need to carry two things, we just carry one thing. And Google Glass is one kind of that program. So in the earlier, Jimmy also uh, gave you some information about Google Company and some of its features, right? And I will talk about some of its features, its component and specification. And the last one is the application. So shall we start? Um, the, uh, the third feature here is a step-by-step -step navigation. You guys may uh, wonder how does this navigation different from your GPS in the car. Well, your GPS in the car, sometimes they didn't use Google Maps, right? They just use uh, their own company map. So uh, it's like it shows you just the map of some countries. Comparing to Google Maps, it uses the Google Map. So you can travel around the world and you can see those maps. The, uh, the next different thing is about uh, your GPS in the car or, uh, only show you the driving route, but the GPS in the Google map show you or the driving route, the walking route, and the riding route. And next thing is when you're driving a car and you have the GPS, I think that it will increase the chance of getting accident by glancing your GPS. When you're driving and turn left, you can see the way this. Right. But when you wear Google Glass, you don't need to press it because the display is on in front of your eyes. And you just, okay, next five minutes, I'm going to turn left. And you can look by the car. Right? So, our next feature the personal assistant, Google Glass is like your, uh, own, your own secret. secret it can, a uh, person can make your schedule by, but you don't need to write it. You know, you just say it a word and it will auto, automatically uh, make a schedule for you. You can also take a note, for example, your lecture or maybe your shopping list by just saying it. And the next thing, you can call in a person or you can take somebody a message by just saying a word. So it's like silly. Okay, up until here, I want to show you some little clip. And by the way, this YouTube is more by Google Offer. So this is the scroll bar. Here is how you see in the Google Glass. Next topic will be about the component and spec of Google Glass. Our first component here is the is nose pad and it's free. Google designed this glass to make it adjustable and fit to the form of your face. So no matter if you are fat, you are slim, you have round face or triangle face, you can everybody can wear this glass because it is adjustable to your face. Um, the next component. This is the camera.
camera. This camera is where you take the, uh, the photo or recording the video. And this is a very high solution. You can take it with a resolution of 5 million pixels. And the video that you record will be high definition. The next part is the prison display. This display is like uh, the screen that you see. So if you have the problem about eyesight, if you have short eyesight and you already wear glass, you don't need to worry that you cannot wear this glass because the normal lens will be up here, like two sides. But this, this place is just like a small part up uh, on the right hand side. The next part is the battery. This battery can use and it will last for one day. This one day we, you use it normally, like you're taking a photo, you listen to music, or you're taking a note, and it will last for one day. The next part is the CPU. It's here. This CPU contains uh, 16 gigabyte memory. Uh, this can be divided to 12 gigabyte on this cell, on this SD card, and 4 gigabyte on cloud storage. And this use Android 4.0 as the, uh, the operation system. Okay, so now I will talk about some of these applications. The first application, uh, of course, is Google Class, so it must have Google search. You can do a search not, not just by your mobile phone. You just say it like when you want to search something, you say, okay, class. Go and you ask him that question, for example, okay, class, was it actually today or time up to this dollar? Um, the next application is Google Map. As I said, Google Map is the one of the base map in the world. Um, this three application uh, is designed for those who learn to pay for. Stava, Stava designed for those who learn to run and ride a bike. The street design for those who love to fitness is, is like your personal coach. Top side, top side design for those who uh, play golf is like your cabin. It can tell you the like, direction of the wind, and tell how strong of the wind, and how far from your point to the hole. So it's like playing a game like that. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, the next one, Google Trip. Google Trip is Designed for those who love to travel. Compass is one of these components. Compass is designed for those who love to go in the backpack, right? Because in the forest, of course, you, you don't have the signal, you don't know the map. So the only thing that helps you is the compass. Field trip, field trip will tell you all the information, background, all the history of the places you go. So just like you're looking at some place and it will scan for you. Uh, all of it, information, all of it, history, something like that. And before I end in this slide, I would like to say some more. Um, computer is the past, tablet is present, and Google Glass is future. So I hope that you all enjoy our presentation. Thank you for your attention.